so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great so in this video i'm going to show you how you can create a basic shape transformation with the help of the particle so without any further delay now let's get started tutorial this video we'll just talk about only how these settings are work this is a very basic tutorial about it and the second part will talk about some advanced settings also and we will use the cycle for the rendering because right now i use the ev because this is a only for understanding purpose and uh, right now here you can see i just uh, transform the cube to the uh spare but it's a very basic uh, animation in the part 2 we'll use the uh, cycle for the rendering and these circle will look more realistic so stay tuned with me guys and uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and make sure you watch this video till end because this is the basic settings which is i will not refer it in the part 2 okay so now let's start the tutorial so here you can see guys this is my project file and this is the same animation which is i have shown you before so now let's start the tutorial so first of all i'm just going to tell you uh, how it's uh, created basically so i have used the four sphere and uh, for the different color and this is the main plane just contain the all particle settings and uh, i'm going to delete it first of all this plane and i'm just going to unhide my cube and the uv sphere here you can see and i'm not going to delete the four uv sphere because this is the basic here you can see i just used the emission shader on it okay i just put the color and after that i just change the surface as a mission so you can this is not a new for you okay and these are the basic shapes you can add from the shift a and here from the mesh section you can add the uv sphere and cube okay so now let's start the tutorial so here you can see guys we have a basic object here so first of all i'm just going to add one particle system uh, into this cube pressing the plus icon and here you can see just leave it the as a emitter so right now we don't need to change anything from the settings and uh, make sure you apply the same physics setting on this cube as well from the here yeah so right now here you can see if i will play the animation we have a same particle settings in both object so now i will just add one plane here pressing the shift a adding on plane and keep this plane to the left hand side something like that and then i will just add one new particle settings on it here you can see so right now we have to change some settings so first of all we'll change this uh, physics settings to physics type as a keyed okay so after that i will just go to the my relation section and from here i will add one uh, add one new relation and i will just uh, use this target object as a cube then i will add one more and right now i will use as a spare okay so now we have a two relation object into this plane settings okay and we don't need to change anything but we have to change only one thing we have to just go to render setting and from here we have to change the hollow to the hollow to the collection and then i will just change the, and then i will just select the all uv sphere and i will just do control g and i will change this name as a balls okay and after that i will just scroll it down and from here we will see it will ask the collection so i will just select this balls collection okay so here you can see if i will hide this uh, cube okay if i will hide this cube and uh, this uv sphere from the viewport the color of the uh, particle it's change okay but right now that is not happening same which is i have shown you in the f uh, in the starting of this video so for that we have to change only one setting so that setting basically we have to just go to the again the particle section and from here we have to change the the end frame to the one as well and after that if i will play the animation so here you can see that animation is happening same like before but there is one problem the uh, some particles are going to fall down which is not looking cool so how we can rid of this problem we have to just go enable this cube and from the physics panel we have to just uh, change this physics type as a none and same thing we will uh, do with the spare as well we'll just select the spare and go to the physics type as a none and now it's fine okay and we can just unhide uh, we can just disable from the viewport and make sure to disable from the render view as well okay if you don't want to disable from this uh, the collection bar so there is one option it's called a uh, render and you can just delete the uh, you can just uncheck the show emitter so it will also not show in a render view as well so there is uh, it's up to you where you want to uh disable the that object okay so now if i will show if i will play the animation so here you can it's working very nicely here you can see but we have to just uh, make this background color whole black and uh, set this end frame to the 50 okay and now here you can see 
that's happening very nicely but that's how you can create a shape transform effect with the help of the particles okay and this is very basic uh, option which is i have shown you here part two we'll talk about some uh, advanced settings okay and uh, we'll make some cool animation with the help of this uh, option with the help of this uh, particle settings tool okay so stay tuned with me guys and thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button hit the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries if you have any suggestion please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys